guys if you're in night one and i'm bringing you another best option for the outer worlds this will probably be the last best option one because i think this is the last mission where you have two feuding factions that can be ended relatively peaceably today we're talking about the msi and the icono class now these are two of the main factions on monarch this is by far the longest of the best option missions so i just recommend doing everything basically before you even go to the radio tower and flip the switch. Why? Because once you flip the switch, this happens. Now both MSI want the targeting module, but don't bring it to either of them. What you do is, if you've done everything else, go to Sanjar and talk to him about working out a peaceful resolution he won't do it unless you give him Zora's employee review so do that first and then just bring him the review then afterwards go to talk to Zora and if you haven't already and find out who was responsible for giving the pirates access to the city which caused the amber city heights slaughter you'll find out it was Graham and after you leave and come back Zora will want to confront him now I've tried to work out a peaceful solution I tried to talk to him first it doesn't seem like you can get this without killing him so this is the only one of these best option choices where you actually have to kill somebody now after you kill Graham Zora will be in charge you talk to her about setting up this peace meeting you go to the peace meeting and you actually have to still talk them into working together you have to give them ideas give them options basically and you can even tell them to hug it out at the end I'm sorry, but I'll need to sign a physical contact waiver first. But after all this, finally, you will have both the MSI and Iconoclast working together. And once again, both will review you. Well, that's my last video for the best options in Outer Worlds when it comes to the factions. Thanks for watching, like, and subscribe. May God bless you all.